but not that much time. You mentioned um, Hillary Clinton, who's now the Democratic candidate for the presidency. Um, I, you've been taking an interest, I understand, in the whole issue of the email she sent you're using her private server. Do you have any of the undisclosed emails? Well, taking interest, I think, is putting it mildly. We've published 32,000 uh, of them in some analysis. Mm. Uh, it's, we have upcoming leaks in relation to Hillary Clinton, which yep. is great. We actually have a, WikiLeaks has a very big year uh, so, ahead. But some, but some, of, the, some uh, of the ones but, that have not yet come into the public domain, you are planning yeah. to put out. We have emails related to Hillary, Hillary Clinton, which uh, are pending uh, publication. That is correct. But the, the what about the FBI the investigation? What, do you, what, what, what about the FBI yeah. investigation itself? Where do you think that will end up? Well, uh, unfortunately, I think what's going to happen is that the, the FBI is going to go uh, where we've accumulated a lot of uh, material about Hillary Clinton. We could pr proceed to an indictment. But if you've got Loretta Lynch as the DOJ, uh, head of the DOJ in the United States, appointed by Obama, uh, Loretta Lynch is the person in charge of our case. Uh, She's not going to indict uh, Hillary Clinton. That's not possible. That could happen. But the FBI can push for concessions from uh, the new Clinton government uh, in exchange for its lack of indictment. But there's, there's very strong material, both in, uh, in the emails and in relation to the Clinton Foundation. For example, we published an email where Hillary Clinton is instructing her staff to remove the classified header of a classified document and send it by non-classified fax. Uh, so that it just requires one more thing, which is to show that the document was actually sent. But she instructed her staff to violate those uh, uh, classification procedures in the United States. Of course, I think personally a lot of these procedures are ridiculous, but Hillary Clinton uh, has been uh, pushing to prosecute others, and so has Barack Obama, uh, who violate technically uh, these procedures. Very briefly, I mean, plainly, what you are saying and what you've been publishing hurts Hillary Clinton. Would you prefer Trump to be president? Well, uh, I think tr Trump is a completely unpredictable uh, phenomenon. You, ca you can't predict what he would uh, do in office. You can predict a bit more what the Republican Party would do in office. Uh, from my personal perspective, well, you know, the emails we published show that Hillary Clinton is receiving constant updates about my personal situation. Mm. She has uh, pushed uh, for the prosecution uh, of WikiLeaks, which is still in train. Uh, so we do see her as a bit of a problem uh, for freedom of the press more generally. Uh, and in relation to wars, uh, the emails we revealed about her involvement in Libya and statements by Pentagon generals show that Hillary was overriding the Pentagon's reluctance uh, to overthrow uh, Muammar al-Gaddafi because they, would, they predicted that the post-war outcome would be something like what it is, which is ISIS taking over the country. It's Hillary who was the leading champion uh, in office to do that. Uh, she has a, a long history of being a liberal got, war hawk. Uh, uh, and we, we presume that she's going yeah. to proceed. I'm really uh, sorry, Mr. Assange, but I'm being told we're out of time. But it's been a j pleasure talking to you and hope to speak to you again. Thank you. Bye All bye. the best. Thank you.